hello from slide node and hello from waves in the last vid i was talking about some methods of your string buffer string builder now in this vid i'm gonna go further and talk about more methods inside your string buffer and string builder class so first i'm gonna start with something called insert if i say b dot insert what this does is, is it inserts something at the specified position so for example if you say b dot insert zero and if you say something like high what this is gonna do is this is gonna insert this high in the zeroth position right over here so let's actually run this and see how this looks so as you can see it is high hello from slide down and waves now if you say one over here now as you guys can see the high directly goes at zero one right this is the first position so here it goes directly and as you guys can see it is high yellow right this is how the insert method works you can put anything over here basically just like your append method you can say false over here and it's gonna simply say edge false hello from slider and waves all right so that's what the insert method does you can go ahead and that means play with this method as you want then the same way we have something called set carat i can say b dot set carat index is zero and character something like uh p so what this is going to do is gonna remove the h over here and actually put b in the place of h so let me go ahead and run this and it says bellow from slider and waves in place of hello this is working you what you need is a character over here to take care of stuff right you can also control how long your string buffer should be by saying this set p dot set length the set length basically takes a parameter integer and it tells exactly what is the length of your new string buffer so for example if you say the length is 5 what this is gonna do is basically eliminate everything else and keep only hello so the first five characters if you say like 10 over here if you run this take a look it says hello and from now these are the only two words 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 till then it goes there right so that's what the set length method does ultimately you have the other method which is the simple one reverse if you say b dot reverse it's gonna simply reverse the string buffer now remember all these methods modify the original object the string of the string class is immutable but the string buffer you can modify stuff when you play with the methods right so let me go ahead and run this so here if you see it's completely reversed with the b dot reverse function now this reverse you can you can use it to reverse a string or you can use it to reverse a number this is a short trick in java for reversing stuff last but not the least i'll talk about this method replace if i say b dot replace i need to tell what i need to replace right so for example if i want to replace this hello with something else i will say the starting position at zero right the ending position at five and replace that with let's say hi so now this complete hello from 0 to 5 that is your 0 1 2 3 4 5 and that is removed and replaced with high right there's a space and this high comes exactly before the space so the 5 is actually not included if you see the figure over here so you can again play with this let's say if you want to replace this from over here you can probably say 5 and 10 i think that will replace hello or oh, high and we need a space right so i can say 6 10 remember it's a method it's a just a matter of playing a little bit with the values that is your start and end positions remember the ending position is not included the starting position is always included right so that's what the replace method does so i hope you guys have understood something out of this vid how replace works and other methods in string buffer or string builder works now string builder has the same set of methods as a string buffer so you can go to netbeans or eclipse and try them out in string builder and string buffer if you like what you saw please subscribe to my channel comment let me know what you think about this i'll catch you guys later have a nice day. Thanks for watching.